because it's a it says a two on it. Am I too low? So here, drop the one you have, and I'll swap you. All right. So is that what it is? My so, person is holding this sword without any issue. So I think I leveled up from the fight. So maybe you're right. Maybe it is have a level um, tie-in. Okay. Oh, we can oh, rebuild wow. stuff. That's pretty cool. Yeah, we just have to harvest enough materials. Hey, we made it through the first night. <laughs> Hooray! And guess what? There's durability, everybody's favorite. Oh, on the tool? Yeah. Oh, gosh. I found two archers, and I have still not found a place to heal. Oh, run away! Oh, gosh, run away! <laughs> Can't do this right now. Why not? I need to heal. <laughs> A Jotun. Oh, we gotta get him. Oh, gosh. We're gonna die. <laughs> I don't even know where he is. I have to wait 20 seconds before the Cirrus will heal me. Just stop telling me that and heal me. Ah! But she also had like a three minute cooldown, so we won't be able to use her again for a little while. We found like a barricade I'm trying to knock down. Don't know what's over here. Gotcha. Alright, if you Ooh. go to the mortar and pestle icon, you can craft health potions. Oh, it says 90. Oh, nope, not going that way. What is it required for a potion? Um, you need maple sap, which I guess you get from the trees. All right, I'm headed back to the village because I know that they said the monsters are coming soon. I'm looking for them. Oh, there they are. <laughs> Good time to jump in my lap, Alvina. <laughs> <laughs> Just to be distracting. She's helping. Roll some more. Oh gosh, this guy hits hard. Where's the rest of them are right here? No, not the tinkerer. Oh gosh, oh gosh, I'm in trouble. Oh gosh, I'm in trouble. Crawl away, crawl away. My only option is to give up. Oh no. Heal me. That's no good. Heal me, Cirrus. Heal me. <laughs> Stop shooting and heal me. Oh, my sword finally broke. I'm just punching him now. Oof. Oh boy, this sucks. Soul is lost. Revive your loot before it disappears. Well, I'm still level 2, so that's something. We survived another day. Just barely. Holy cow. Well, yeah, I, Are I you got, still here? I got killed, but I'm coming back to reclaim, reclaim my souls. I'm almost dead. Make heal. Here's my stuff. Open it. Hey, you have armor. You're not naked. Yeah, I crafted some. Well, the, the blacksmith doesn't do armor. Who does armor? Uh, this one down here on the bottom right. I want to be a knight, sir. All right, we have to upgrade his station. Station level two required. Yeah, gotcha. how, how, do I, how do I upgrade his station? I'm looking at his little shack here. Is there somewhere else in town you have to go to specifically tell a place to upgrade? Hmm. Um, possibly. I didn't know. Oh, I see it. Here. When I'm looking at him, there's an option that says L1 to upgrade. Gotcha. Um, so he specifically needs 250 souls. Jeez, I have no souls, and our base has no souls almost. Oh, does our, our souls dwindle? Yeah, they go down. Oh, yeah, that makes sense. I got some basic armor. Which now my cosmetics are working where I look like that cosmetic armor that I had selected gotcha. earlier. You just had to have a baseline. A stag has descended Ooh. from the world tree. Would that be Idrisil? Like, so in town? Oh, it's up there. If you pull up the main map, you can see it's up north. Oh, there is a triangle, a yellow triangle on our compass. Yeah, I think that's it. So we're going to go hunt down a stag now? I think so. This might be the ramp that I went up to that said the the power was 100. Though right now my power is 111. Yeah, mine's 101. Tear the walls down. Burn it to the ground. Yeah, loot. Woo. We love loot. Look at all them loots. Alright, where's the deer? Whoa, look at that guy. Big werewolf looking dude. Hey, hey, knock it off. Knock it off, wolf boy. You can see why the more players you have, the way better off you'll be. I got some fur. I think we're walking above the path that it intended. 
looking at the map. Well, maybe we can find a ramp down. Yeah, there's some archers. Are they emissaries of the Gorgonites? Archer, emissary of the Gorgonites. No, I can't get down that way. Mm. 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 <laughs> you can't harvest it, I'm harvesting. Come here, pigs. Puma, get back over here. All right, so let's come backtrack to... The ramp? Yeah. Let me tell you, it's a lot better having some kind of armor. Like, I'm taking damage so much slower <laughs> than before. Before yeah. it was like I was barely being touched and dying very fast. Yeah, I just made, like, the first level thing, so... Okay, that makes more sense. Now we're on the path that I could see on the map, so... I think we're getting close. I see a yellow ring. And there's a fire icon. Oh god, a bunch of enemies. Oh, it's a base. All my base are belong to me. Oh, whatever that was, it took damage. And it exploded. Oh, cool. Oh, he dropped a golden thing. Taking all the things. Cool. Honorable treasure. There's a heal place. You getting it? Do you have to also activate it? No, I think I can't do it if you're doing it. Interesting. But that's okay. You need it more than I do, so. Yeah, it was dying. All right, I do see a ramp that I think we need to cross. Yeah, it's right here. Oh, cool. Oh no! Of course they're gonna attack while we're we didn't look at the time. I don't even know how to read that damn clack. But <laughs> we can warp. <laughs> Let's see the stag. I think it's in the water. Hmm. I see crabs in the water. Judging by his location. Well, let's warp back to town. Open the Bifrost! Yeah, mine's not doing it. What the hell? Uh oh, maybe because I used it? Well, maybe the controls are different? Well, down at the bottom, I just saw the little rock. Right, R3. Right, 3. Press it in. Ah! Okay. The screen's too big. Too big, Morty. It takes like it literally has a timer for like three seconds until you travel, and I was obviously activating it and then shutting it off, activating it, shutting it off. So I wasn't sure. All right, I gave it two hundred twenty souls. It's back to being in the yellow, but it was in the red. All right, let's fight all the dudes. I'm not sure that the rolling actually helps because <laughs> I can't ever time it right. I get hung up in the animation. My combo animation. All right, I'm reviving the Tinkerer. Oh, and I got an achievement for it. Oh, cool. Hey, leave our tree alone, man. Oh, nice. I used one of my potions. There's a thousand eight hit points. That's good to know. Yeah, that was a basic one too. Granted, you know our our bar is like 3,000 something, so. Alright, I went ahead and used the other two. <laughs> we got to level 3, baby. Jeez, this guy's a tank. He's taking a million hits. We survived another day. Oh, our tree only has 500, though. It's not doing great. Yeah, I don't know how to harvest them any faster. The Yoden is close to our village. All right, well, I'm full up, and... Oh, the red icon has moved, so that must be him. The red triangle on the compass? Uh, I gotcha, yeah. I don't see, see I... him on the map because we haven't cleared the map far enough. See, I thought that was just a north icon, but he's definitely uh, coming from a different location, and it's, it's pulsating. Yeah, we've got the warning that he's close. Oh, crap, my weapon is going to break. <laughs> well, I'll break it on his face! What did you push to bring up the map? Uh, the touchpad. Okay. 
Oh yeah, that does not tell me at all where he is. Yeah, he's off the map. He's too far away. We haven't cleared that part of the map yet. Oh, oh it's getting it's getting blue. I guess that's like the uh, the Night King, right? Where it's getting colder. Yeah, this is like enemy territory. Oh, the Yoden's nearby. That's probably what it is. We've got his. Oh my God! Look at his health bar. <laughs> Eighty-two thousand. Look at him. He's like summoning enemies. Oh, it's like a big lady. Yeah. Oh man, I'm gonna die already. Oh, oh my no, God. kidding! I got hit once, and it like completely drained my health. And I didn't have any uh, health potions or anything. Holy crap, well, dude! That was ridiculous. <laughs> well, obviously, we should not engage the Yodens until we ground up a little bit because holy crap yeah uh I, I mean do we even continue playing or do we just i guess play until the uh tree is dead because we've only got a couple like once yeah. once he, once he gets to the the town we're dead it's game over man yeah the the difficulty spike here is pretty major well i definitely think we're supposed to probably fail at this several times as we're just leveling up our character before we actually have any chance at stopping you know the thing yeah i mean if it's a roguelite you are supposed to die a bunch and i think we'll find out for sure like if we let this we should go ahead and just let this die right just to see what happens like if our equipment retains i feel like our experience probably will well i made a bow but i can't even make arrows yet that makes sense. But let me make another weapon then. Oh, I need iron. I don't have any iron. Well, I can try to attack the uh, Jotun again just for lulls. I wonder if I can bait it away from the village. Like, you know, buy you some time. Like if you were at the town trying to fortify the, the buildings. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if you can slow it down or... It does seem like the uh, Blood Moon, I mean, more enemies... I'm getting too close to the Yoden. Imagine trying to play this solo. Like, we're only doing it with yeah. just the two of us. I do think the next time we jump into a lobby, we should do it with ten. Because I yeah. think that we'll, we'll have much better success. Yeah, and I'm hoping that more stuff retains than I think. Like, basically the base stuff starts fresh, but you uh, carry over. That's what I'd like to think. Well, I, I heard her I heard her for a whole 400 damage. <laughs> I can't imagine your items carry over necessarily. Well, I mean, they they fall apart anyway, so they don't really have a lot of uh, long term. That's true. Let me look at the. Oh, let me look at the. Yeah, there's durability on everything. Okay, including your armor and your weapons and your tools. That makes sense. So yeah, probably just your stats carry over then. Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! I'm dead. Guys, <laughs> I, 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 I died so bad. Uh, okay. Yeah, I think we're uh, we're playing hard mode here by by ourselves. Well, no worries. We'll just sit here and watch you know Ragnarok roll in and suck out the life of our you know, Idris. <laughs> yeah, it's fine. But how close is it? Pretty close. He's pretty close. <laughs> All right. Well, go out swinging. Yeah, that's that's what I was doing. <laughs> I don't even have any more souls because I just died to give the tree. Well, this was fun. I, I even though we were played a hopeless game that we could not win, I, I definitely liked the idea behind it, and it does have some elements, like I said, that remind me a bit of, of Fall Guys, but in the best kind of way. It seemed like a lot of it was a cosmetic sort of thing, because like you have to earn your weapons in the world you're playing. So you might have a cosmetic thing that makes it look like you have a goofy head on, but I don't think it gives you any actual in-game bonus it's just for cosmetics so that's my favorite way to have the sort of microtransactions where you can't really pay for your success oh wow the health healed by the way then the couple hundred damage i did to it it's good it's back it's back to full health uh, that figures i um right now i am uh it's auto switch to the bow that i made but mm -hmm. there are some default infinite arrows oh that's nice yeah i saw that you could craft arrows and i thought well i can't even craft these but uh, I do have a range weapon that I can use, so I can try to keep my distance. Oh, good timing. Good timing. 
Oh, they don't even care that I'm smacking her. She just went right for the tree. Oh, and there it goes. Didn't even make it back. Oh no, no more dead. Dum dum dum, the end.